Hello everyone, this is uh, Bernstein Hearst. Uh, I own Hearst Trailers, me and the kids that uh, we've raised here, our family. We're gonna try to start something maybe that would help you guys distinguish what kind of trailer you want and where you wanna buy it, just by simply showing you what we do. Uh, we'll be going into facts that later of how they're made, where they're made, we'll show you uh, a complete assembly of where they come from, how they start, where they're sawed from. Uh, today we're going to show you a utility line of trailers that we do. Uh, this trailer here is a sort of a special trailer to start with, but it is a 6-6, six -six, which is our standard width. And we also do seven wides in trailers. But it is a 16-foot trailer. We never would build a 16-foot trailer. But we started it and we put a 5,200-pound axle under the trailer to accommodate the weight to where that... Uh, we can haul up to 5,200 pounds on this trailer with uh, one axle. It has a 15-inch radial tire. Uh, which carries over carries the load uh, it has braking axles under it this trailer has got a breakaway on it five inch channel tongue to sufficiently carry the load and then we go from that it's got the wood flooring two base treated pine we use all number one grade two base treated pine uh, the wiring is all in conduit. We'll show you that later. This is spire mounts that we put on everything we build. Uh, it will accommodate any spire tar, yours or ours. This trailer here is a, a 14 foot tanda, or 14 foot single axle trailer. It has 3,500 pound axles on it. Now that means it's got a five lug idler axle. This is your standard utility size wheel and tar. Our tars are 15 inch radials that overrates the axle completely. Uh, we use a three by two angle top and bottom rail on everything except five wide trailers. Uh, this trailer is seven wide. It is actually 84 inches clear inside. You can look at our trailers and you can tell the difference in the width without a measuring tape. This one will have 11 boards in it and that uh, ends up being 84 inches. So the trailer has got uh, an extension on each side of the gate if you look the way it's made, which accommodates the, the extra six inches. There's three on each side to make it work. These gates are pinned. All of them are pinned exactly the same way. You take your pins out, you slide it to the right, the gate comes off and then you will put it back on at any time. We use a two inch coupler on everything that we, the small trailers. We use a uh, safety chain that's underneath. We put four inch channel on every tongue except five by eights and five by tens. Uh, it's, we do colors. This is what right here is a color. Okay, here's, here's a 6 by 12, 3,500 pound idler axle. And oh, just just for information, uh, that 14 foot right there with uh, 7 by 14 is $1980. $1,980. It's got LED lighting. All the two wiring is in tubing. Number one grade flooring, primed and painted all over. Uh, radial tires and over rating on the, of the capacity. This trailer right here is a six by 12. We offer colors. If you uh, take something we've got for the same price, if we have to do special colors, it's $100 for the color. Notice our fenders, uh, the gussets that is constructed on every fender. You can use them. A lot of people call them step. We put them on there for strength to where that they hold. Also, all our fenders have got backs in them. Uh, to where that you don't throw dirt on everything when you do. 
Um, it's a, this is a John Deere tri color trailer. It is a true John Deere green. Uh, this trailer is 1780 if you want to take it. It's 78 by 12. Here's a trailer that is, uh, people asked about dovetail. It's a, this is another six by 12. It has a two foot dovetail on the back. It's black in color, of course. Same exact trailer as this green one we just looked at, only it has a two foot dove approach on the back. And this is an option of $40 to get the dovetail on the back of the trailer. Our gates, if you'll notice on even the green or any other trailer gate, we've got nine verticals. They're ever eight inches for where that people have to run, put boards on the gates that they buy trailers elsewhere to keep it from falling through. Ours has got nine verticals in a regular 78. It has 11 in a seven foot. So they're not gonna break through. They're 49 inches tall. So you'll, that's as big a gate as you'd want. We also have options of uh, the grill lifts that will fashion right here. If one boat goes right here, it's $400 option. A spring assist is what it comes out to be. Um, here's another. Uh, this is a 12 as well. This is exactly the same trailer as what the, the John Deere green or the black with the dove, only this is a straight back, but it's a Kubota orange. Uh, this trailer, we have several of these. Uh, we'll take uh, 1780 for this trailer. It's with the spare and the gate, everything just as you see, it's ready to go. Um, our trailers here, like this trailer, now this is six by 12. Reason the gate's not on because we have people come and get multiple trailers and they take this gate and lay it down. They put a double head on the back and they pull more than one trailer behind it. Um, we are at Washburn, Tennessee. We have been here 49 years. Uh, this is all I know. I love to work with people. I love to do what I do. Uh, Lord's willing, we'll take you and show you how they're made in the coming days. And if you've got any questions, why well, just email us or whatever. Uh, God's been good to us and we want to give him all the honor and the glory. Thank you for listening to us today.